Okay, I'm going to be showing you in this tutorial how to add a creative license to your Google Sites. So I already have opened up the Creative Commons website and if you notice down here it goes choose a license. Okay, what I recommend for this particular project is you allow adaptations of your work to be shared but not for commercial use. So you would click that as no. Now down here let me just scroll up, okay? So you're going to have the Creative Commons license. You're going to allow people to share it, but you are not going to allow them to do it for commercial reasons, okay? Um, there's some other options here, and that if you pick this one, that means that other people can use your information, but they would also have to have a creative license, license on where they share it. I don't think it's necessary for this particular project, so let's just go um, yes and we don't need, we'll just use these two, okay? So again, people can um, share your information, but they do need to give you credit. So down here, you would copy this code. I've just clicked copy it. I'm just gonna take the normal icon option. You could take a compact one and watch what happens now that I've copied it. I'm going to go to a old website I have right now. And for now, let me just close that out so you can see this is what it looks like, okay? and I want to add that Creative Commons license to the footer. So I'm going down here to the gear. I'm selecting Edit Site Layout, and one of the choices up here is Custom Footer. I'm going to click on that, go down here where the Custom Footer would be, okay, down here, do you see that now that I've turned on Custom Footer? Click, and I'm going to pick this option. It's the last option. Okay, edit HTLM source. And what I'm putting in here is an HTLM source. And so I'm going to paste it in there. That's to, it's just an HTML code. And when I go update, notice now that footer will have the Creative Commons license and the information about it. And when I go OK, OK, you can see it is in the footer. Okay, and I'm now going to close the edit site layout. So again, the gear, when I went to the gear here, I went to edit site layout and selected custom footer. And when I selected custom footer, I'm going to just do it another time to show you. I went down here and I took this last option, HTML, and then I pasted in that code I got from the Creative Commons site. And again, it's under licenses, choose a license. And that's where I was able to get the option. And I picked allow adaptations of my work to be shared and I do not want it to be used for commercial purposes and then just simply copy this. So I hope that um, clarifies for you the process. And uh, just wanted to share that with you, so that would end this tutorial for now.